Hey, the water isn't working. Yeah, I'll have to go turn the pump on. Hopefully the lines aren't still frozen. Do you mind opening some windows? It's some light in here. Do you think it will be warm enough to swim this weekend? Are you kidding? It's probably freezing. I was thinking of doing pancakes in the morning. I'll run to the store and grab a box of mint. We need to talk about Dad. Yeah, for sure. The store closes in 15 minutes. I'm just gonna run over, I'll be right back. Would you relax? I'm just stepping out for a moment. We can talk when I get back. Not that there's anything to talk about. Relax. You didn't say a word the whole drive up here. We haven't seen each other since the funeral. I figured we could at least talk about it now. There's nothing to talk about. He was an old man. He should have retired years ago. Why do you talk about him like that? You know, he loved his job. He worked hard. You can't blame him for that. He kept working so he could support us. To support you? No. He was supporting both of us. Well, he wasn't paying for my education. Excuse me? You're a career student. First you wanted to be a doctor, but that didn't work out. Then you wanted to be a psychologist. Then you took a year off to find yourself. And now you're an artist? If it wasn't for you changing your mind every two years, he could have retired a long time ago. What is wrong with you? The store closes in 13 minutes. Do you want to keep having this conversation, or do you want pancakes? Don't you dare blame me for Dad's death. You don't get to do that. He would have supported you too if, if you had any interest. Not everyone can take the first job they get and just be happy with it. Sorry, I had aspirations and wanted to do something with my life, and you're happy doing nothing with yours. He had a heart attack. You can't blame me for that. I had figured it out sooner. Or maybe if I just worked to save up my own money. Do you really think it would have made a difference? No. Of course not. Dad loved his job. He would have found a reason to keep working no matter what. I'm sorry. It's fine. I'm going to take a walk. I said that. It wasn't fair. Do you remember when you and Dad built the dock? I remember Dad building the dock. I just held his tools all weekend. You did more than that. You asked Dad questions about every single thing he did. By the end of the weekend, you probably knew enough to build the dock by yourself. Dad loved sharing that part of himself with you. I know what made him really happy that you followed in his footsteps. And you're so good at it. 
I'm happy you were able to find your passion so early. You were just as big a part of that day. And besides, you found your passion early too. You just didn't realize it yet. We all had a part in making this dock. I almost forgot about this. I remember you grabbing pieces of scrap wood from the pile. You sat right over there in your own little world, painting on them until we were done. Dad loved this one so much, he just had to incorporate it into the dock. Dad was always your number one fan. He loved your creativity and always knew it would take you somewhere. I'm going to miss him. Me too.